my tiny garden grows inside an anniversary clock dome. I struggled for years to maintain the accuracy of this clock and it didn't work. I cleaned the gears, I filed them off, I removed any nicks with some 400 grit sandpaper and it still wouldn't keep an accurate time. So I disposed of all the inner workings and I planted this garden instead. As you can see towards the back there is now lichen that I've imported and there's some on the forward pagoda also. Uh, there's yellow, orange, and green. And there is some down below the front pagoda too. I'm hoping by pre-wetting that I won't have to glue this stuff to the pagodas and it will eventually take over the entire roof of these. You can see the spider web glistening in the background going from pole to pole and I was surprised that it actually had covered the whole top of this garden. I just now noticed it when I went to put in the lichens. So much for a tiny garden inside an anniversary clock dome. As you can see, I put a glass plate on top of the brass bottom. Put some silicone to hold it in place. It gives it a touch of class and a perfect surface for the dome to seal on. In a couple hours, this will be covered with dew inside there. And it will be a lot more difficult to see inside the dome. This is where you can allow your imagination to run wild in little fantasy worlds where things really do come to life. This is the Mad Camera Guy. Thanks for watching.